1 divided by the square root of x is the same as x to the power of negative 1 half. So by rewriting this as this, we can easily integrate using the power rule. So the square root is what gives that power of 1 half, and getting it out of the denominator is what gives us that negative power. Now that we've just got it as a power of x, we can integrate this by adding 1 to the power and then dividing by that new power. Negative 1 half plus 1 is negative 1 half plus 2 halves, which is equal to 1 half. Thus, when we integrate this, we get x to the 1 half, and then we need to divide by that new power. Dividing by 1 half is the same as multiplying by 2, so we have a factor of 2 out front, and then plus the arbitrary constant. Again, that's just the reverse power rule. Add 1 to the exponent to get 1 half, and then divide by that new exponent, and that's a factor of 2. Finally, we might want to rewrite this as 2 times the square root of x. x to the 1 half is the square root of x. So 2 root x plus c, that is our final answer.